Hey, hey, Spring Lafay, Simply Tarot. Okay, Gemini, this is a reading for you. So, what have you got going on? What's going on for Gemini today? Okay, something is calling for you to have strength. Um, this is something it feels like for some is very profound, um, life changing, dramatic. Um, Exploding. Oh my goodness, I'm getting so many different feels from this. Come in more for Gemini. Justice. Okay. Damn. Look at there. Doggone it. Um, whew, mercy. Okay, something's really out of balance. Um, justice is here. I feel like for some of you, I'm going to be honest, I feel like for some of you, uh, you could, this could be court related or there could be um, a higher power involved. Now, this can be, you know, we've got justice, we've got the emperor on the bottom. We've got no balance here at all. We've got no stability, no, um, you know, no going forward, no um, going in another direction. This is kind of like needing to have strength because you're kind of where you are and that's that. Um, this is a feeling like, oh my God, and the hair fonts on the bottom. So for some of you, for some of you, I feel like this is marriage related. And I'm going to be honest with you, the truth is going to come out about something. Um, I don't know if this has got to do with you or the other person. Tell me about this, if this is uh, a divorce or marriage related. Okay. Good grief. You're dealing with somebody um, that is a drama queen. Could be a male, though. Doesn't have to be a female. Um, okay. Oh, God, this ain't looking good. Um, whoever this is, they're not very family-oriented, not very loving, not very caring. Um, they don't give a crap about what you feel, how you go, what, whatever. You know, it doesn't matter to them. Um Oh, this person's got a bad way of looking at things, I'm telling you. So I don't know if this if this is you, you need to change the way you're looking at things. But I feel like from a lot of you, it's not you, it's someone you're dealing with. Okay, tell me going forward. Okay, hermit. Okay, you need to just stay back. Um, I feel like don't, you know, if this is a divorce, you need to get a good lawyer. Um... And I feel like that's, you know, what justice is trying to, yeah. See, they throw it out again. You need to get a good lawyer. You need to get a good lawyer because I'm telling you, um, you're dealing with something that, whew, it doesn't feel like it's good. Um, you know, if you, whew. yeah, something's ending. You have a change going on here. And um, the, uh, you need to have a lawyer. You need to have someone to defend you, defend your rights. Um, and I feel like, now that's if this is um, divorce related or got to do with a, a relationship. There could be children involved or a home, um, losing something. Um, watch how you, how you act. Uh, don't lose your cool. To don't lose your cool. Just stay, you know, kind of quiet. Let your defense talk for you. Don't lose your cool. Yeah. See, uh, going forward, if you'll walk in the walk the walk, they tell you to walk. <laughs> That's what I'm getting. Um, look at things the way that they tell you to look at them. You know, in other words, you're gonna have to tell them. You're going to have to be honest with your, um, this is about, this has got to do with something going through court. You can have a victory, but you're going to have to think back about it. Um, I feel like that things can go your way with the, the star card coming out here. And um, there can be an equal balance within what's going on here and having to do with children. The truth is going to come out. Now, people will get hurt. Um, I mean, it's just pretty much, and it may be you. Um, I feel like that um, 
there's not much you know this is the ending whatever this is it's the ending there ain't much that and it's time for a transformation with the world card being here you're going through this transformation something's ending a relationship and you know someone's going to walk out of your life but at the same time i feel like that um you you got yourself and you can go forward and you know you can you can um really do good for yourself i feel like that you do need to get a good lawyer don't just settle i mean don't just go, oh no 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 don't just go see the card that wanted to come out you need to get a good lawyer this may be a, a very masculine person this is someone who um you need to get a lawyer who um oh, the right one's going to be very family oriented very firmly fair family oriented uh someone who has got a rooted family life you know and and this is someone that can get you what you deserve get you what um is rightfully yours you know um this person can take a lot of that load off of you of worry so you need to get that that perfect lawyer um and um i don't don't jump for the first one i'm telling you uh also i'm 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 seeing look look at the uh their ratings because i feel like the, for some of you this has to do with a home um and um children and I, I feel like you're dealing with somebody who is not oh my goodness they're not in a good light you know they're full of drama they'll put everything on you uh they're not very um they don't follow their intuition they're not very spiritual they don't uh they're not very religious they're uh, not very mothering nurturing caring um and i feel like that they've pushed you into this point where you're just kind of like the queen of swords energy but at the same time you need to be more of um be the queen of swords and stand your ground you see what I'm saying? But at the same time, be very nurturing and caring with the Queen of Pentacles. And work very hard. See? You do what you need to do. You do what you need to do because justice is going to be on your side, it feels like. You see what I'm saying? Now, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, this person's going to clean their act up. They're going to clean their act up. But you need to just keep following your intuition, doing what you need to do. Uh, tell things like they like they are, like they happened in the past, you know, um, and um, be be honest about where you stand and how things happened, how they went about, <coughs> um, because it feels like that truth will prevail. So if the truth is on your side, then you'll prevail. Uh, it's all about truth, you know. And the one that's not in the truth is not going to prevail. It's that type of feeling. Nope. Okay. This is about truth. And, um, and this could very well be a, a higher, uh, for some of you, a higher power, you know, and, um, that's for some of you. But for a lot of you, this is something now. Court. You just need to keep your cool. Definitely don't let... Um, don't let them take you away from that. Okay, 24, third eye chakra. And you've got, um, I see the wisdom of my higher self and apply this wisdom in my life. So that's important for you at this time. Oh. Yeah, I'm a little under the weather at the moment. I thought it was allergies, but... I don't think it is anymore. Okay. Now I have the... There it is. You got a star. 
and it says you deserve the best reach for the stars with your dreams and desires and don't compromise so you know you you've got this the truth truth will set you free the truth prevails uh, so that's what i've got for you um i feel like with this one um in the extended i feel like i'm actually going to um i'm gonna ask a little bit more about for one i want to ask a little bit more about just you in general going forward after this event um, but I also want to look at if you're dealing with um, an Aries. Let's see, who all do I want to look at? I'm going to look at some different ones here. Um, Virgo. Oh my goodness. Mm. <coughs> I feel like I need to look at um, Taurus. Also, and I'm gonna go ahead and look at Scorpio since we've got Aries showing up and we have the Death card that showed up. So, <coughs> I'll look at both of those. Um. Let's see. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. I feel like that, um... <coughs> I'm just trying to see where else I'm drawn to. I feel like I need to look at also um, Capricorn and Libra. Yeah. I'm looking to see if there's any more. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> um. Let's, let's also look at um, Cancer while we're at it. Since we've got the High Priestess there, we're going to look at Cancer and Virgo. Okay, in the extended, I'll, I'll get a, a look-see further, futuristic. But I'll also look at if you're dealing with a Libra, an Aries, um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, <coughs> Cancer, and Scorpio. So yeah, thumbs up. Please do subscribe. Um, much light and love. Till next time. Bye.